good afternoon everybody or maybe even good uh good morning if you're on the the west coast or somewhere else in the world uh welcome to dave the diver time uh sorry for the short notice on the stream i kind of lost track of time today because it's cold and sir doggo is a siren to the bed because he's so warm <laughs> he's a little bit upset now i get the feeling my neighbor is almost home so we might have sir doggo pop in a little Welcome in Chart to Darby, Koala, Reeb, hello. I haven't played this in a bit, it feels. I know I'm supposed to catch tuna. I also, <laughs> in setting up, I forgot to change the stream name, so all of the, uh, all of the settings were just reused. Oh my god, that was my jaw. Okay. So, we have a quest to go beyond the rock pile, but we also need to catch tuna for this event. And I think the tuna is more important, so that's what we're gonna do. Uh, Eco Watcher, what have you for me today? I can't turn jack shit in, so... <laughs> How's my funds looking? Also, Cooksta. Nope, I need to like those. Rank up. <gasps> I can rank up. How did I do that? Do I wanna rank up? Oh boy, um, probably. Would you like to go to sushi restaurant and proceed getting ranked on Cooksta? What? Wait. Wait, I need to, I needed to fish. What has happened? Did I just screw myself out of a day to get tuna? Bodega cat! Oh my god, I want sushi so bad now. Why am I torturing myself with this? All right, we can add menu slot, kitchen staff, more wasabi, added interior. Very nice. Um, It's still morning. I don't think I screwed myself. Um... Should I put out, should I put out a call for staff? Maybe, let's see. Oh, I can add someone else in the kitchen. Um, Do I want to add someone else in the kitchen right now? Possibly not. Can tuna guitar, but you can't tuna fish. <laughs> you know what tuna is? That's fish by Gabe. Gabe. What's that from Koala? Also, how is everybody? I know it's early in the day-ish for some of us, not all of us, but earlier in the day-ish. How are you at this time? Lilo and Stitch. Oh, shit. Right. Okay, how do I wanna... I don't wanna decorate yet. I'm still poor. Ooh, new things to research. In part based on a koala. That's really cute. Trying to rapidly finish a video about how to take an L. Like in terms of just how to respond if you've lost or. Aw, oh, man. All right, whatever. Well, menu. Ow. Okay, I think I. All right. I think I can go back to the boat and start catching things. We running. Look at them working so hard to get our restaurant set up. Some of your students need to handle L's better in activities. Yeah, it can be hard to, to lose. Um, but it's all about how you respond to it. I hope they learn. I hope it goes well. Oh, Bancho Sushi uploaded a new photo. Well, we gotta like that. <gasps> we got published! We got more likes. Okay. Um, I'm gonna hire that other chef tonight when I get back to the restaurant. Because we are gonna get popular real quick. Okay. 
Okay, so I need to catch a tuna. All right. Wee, let's go into the sea. Under the sea. Under the sea. Okay, I need to find some tuna. Wait. There they are. How did I... How do I use this again? Wait. I've forgotten how to... Oh, no. How to use the net. Did I fuck up? I need to look this up really quick. I've forgotten how to play. <laughs> Oops. How to use net, Dave the Diver. <laughs> I only did it once. Okay. Oh, I needed to buy it. I needed to buy another one before I went down. Shoot, screwed that up. Well, we'll just uh, go on a regular hunting. Hunting? <laughs> hunting trip today. Oh, we got the bang stick. Yeah, I'll take that. Whack, whack. <laughs> so mean. Okay, we don't need that. You think I dive? Yes! A hush dart. Ha! Successfully tranquilized fish could be sold expensive. Oh, shit. I walked right into that. Well, swam, I guess. Okay, where are we going? Hi, TJ. Welcome in. bitch there we go you're coming with me now let's get this Ooh, black vinegar hopefully no miss shoots on innocent fish oh it's gonna happen i know it's gonna happen some of these fish are gonna die horrible deaths because of me and it's all my fault i mean not that they're already not dying horrible deaths but they will die worse deaths. Pew. I mean, just look at this. It's bleeding as I pull it in. Oh, that looks... That's wood. Eh. Can't catch up to these. There we go. I better find an oxygen tank soon. I keep wanting to call these squid, but I guess they're cuttlefish. Oh, well, you're pretty. And I guess pretty tough. Completely futz the slum you're working on. You can't seem to make it work. No, I'm sorry. What do you, how do you even repair? Like, do you have to take everything back apart or? Big Eye Trevally, it's new. I'll take that. Does an FDI tactical breach into the stream? Oh goodness. Welcome in riding Sonic. <laughs> McQueen is in Rocket League, y'all. Oh, wow. For some reason, that sounds like a crossover that should have happened sooner. Oh, crap. I need to find oxygen. Oh my god, why are there so many sharks? Is there any oxygen to speak of? Maybe in here. Aha! Okay, yes, uh, I need this. 
There we go. I think I need to collect these. I do. Okay. Oh, damn. I forgot that I upgraded my harpoon and now it hits very hard. Actually, better grab that. There we go. Nothing like murdering things. <laughs> Welcome in, Crooked Gamer. Last day of the diver screen, a fish was evaporated with a pistol. It was. I felt so bad. Wait, what have I already collected that's so heavy? Yeah, this one's gonna take a bit. <gasps> Welcome in, Crooked Gamer. How are you? If you want me, there you go. See, I don't want to use the... It's already dead. Like, there's no sense in really wasting the thing. Oh, I am overloaded. Hey, that Egyptian dude. How's it going? Welcome in again. Fish murder for profit. Yeah. I mean, you gotta, you gotta eat to live. I wish that I'd remember to bring one of those tuna. Oh well, I'll do it next time. Get some oxygen on the way up, just in case. I don't want to get taken out by a tuna. These things actually hurt you if they catch you. And I'm safe. I have escaped freely. Return to the boat. All right, we got lots of good stuff. been five years since you've eaten i see that someone is superhuman <laughs> all right so we got quite a bit of fish that's good that's good quite a bit expensive fish too okay cobra i guess i need to shop i need to get a net from you there we go. Steel net sensor trap. There we go. Oh, I guess I can only buy one a day. I didn't fuck up. Yay! That makes me happy. Oh, I got an update from the weapon shop. Oh, I guess I've learned to make a hush dart. <laughs> I've halfway learned how to make a hush dart. Tuna are going to catch Twyla in a dark alley. Oh, woof. That's not scary at all. I think they say they can swim up to like 60 miles an hour. Tuna are crazy. Okay, so I've got two, but I only have one call. Two. Oh, never mind. I did mess up. I've got two of these. Okay. All right. Ha! There we go. We got us a tuna. All right. And now we can just progress as usual. Catching even more fish. Tuna are as fast as a car. Yeah, they're crazy fast and enormous too. Maybe it's not 60 miles an hour, but it's, it's fast. Keep in mind, anything I know about tuna may have been learned from Animal Crossing. So don't count me, don't, don't quote me on it. Oh, more tuna. Shame I only have one call to the thing a day or a trip. Okay, I've got jellyfish, but these aren't the type I need. I need the, the egg jellyfish. 
You have the best fish in the whole world? I would love that. I'm a big fish person. Like, breaded fish. Um, oh my god. Grilled fish. Baked fish. Raw fish. So much fish. Fish sticks. Can't go wrong with a good fish stick. Even if it's... I mean, a fish stick. <laughs> I haven't had a fish stick in years. Maybe... Maybe I should treat myself with some salmon soon. You can get a side of salmon and just split it up for four or five meals. It's not... What are these? Are those also tuna? I don't think they are. Oh, there's a shark. I was so distracted by what those other things were swimming around. I didn't even notice the shark. put it in the sun for hours and then you put it in the oven and you have the best fish in town Ooh. I seriously doubt I would be able to find I mean I don't know if I would trust myself to make it myself but I'm sure I could convince one of my friends to do it because he knows a lot more about food than I do and I am so scared about messing things up when I cook I'd be like oh no I'm gonna waste this fish and also, Midwestern Sun is not... I don't think... I don't know if it would be as well suited. Especially now that it's winter. It's so cold. Well, it's not winter, it's fall. But it sure feels like winter today. You dick. This is the first day I've had to turn my air conditioning up. Or not my air conditioning, my heater. Pile is going to catch the whole ocean in this game. I believe that's the point of this game. Catch everything. Am I close to the hole that I'm supposed to explore? I think I am. All right, let's take care of that. We got plenty of oxygen. Not much room, but we can explore what's here and see if I should catch it. Almost did it, but instead of eating fish, you're meeting with the firefighters. Oh, Sea People Record Chamber. This place is, wow. It appears to be some kind of Sea People Record Chamber. My lucky feeling was correct. There definitely was a Sea People civilization in this region. Look at that mural back there. No person could, no human could have painted that so deep underwater. Maybe these are from some ancient civilization that sank from seismic activity. A good point, but that style of painting and architecture can't be seen anywhere above ground. Please first investigate this place. I'm sure you'll be able to find a variety of interesting clues. Interesting. This can't be a natural pillar. There are even mysterious characters engraved in it. Hi, Yahalo. Welcome in. This mural seems to be of a warrior or king. It looks powerful. There seem to be scales on the lower body. Is this really a mural of the sea people? <coughs> a painting of dolphins and marine plants. Apparently the sea people could draw and not only write. Good, that should be enough. I'd like to research a little more, so please take a photo with the camera I gave you. Take a picture of the mural. I guess I come back up. Ah! Hello, camera sensor. Boop. New content. Camera. A camera icon indicates you can take pictures. Check your objective on the top left. Huh. Use A to adjust the focus and remove your hand to take a picture. Make sure your timing matches the green indicators.
Wait. Oh, I see. I see what they want me to do. Okay. Uh-oh. Huh? I see something on the floor there. Oh, might be another Sea People artifact. Bring it to me. All that fish talking makes you want it to be fish. The Pulte fish? Hmm. Here we go. Oh, people are whispering. Lovely. I don't know why I'm coughing. I think it's just because it's, um, it's fall. The, the change in weather's got me, that's all. See, I realized I haven't fished all year. My friends and I, my friend, well, one friend, one friend and I would go fishing every year. We'll have to make sure we catch trout season this year. Even if I only caught a single trout and it was the smallest out of all six that we caught. I use we loosely because I only caught the one. More importantly, didn't you hear something? What do you mean? I didn't hear anything over the radio. Come back up to the boat for now. Go back up, up to the boat. No, I'm going to catch some stuff first. You seem to forget that I am running a business. Well, not running a business. I'm helping in the business. Yep. Yeah, what have I caught? I've caught a catfish, but it was too small, so I let it go. Lots of drum. Lots of drum and lots of crappie. Seemed to be most of what I could find. I like that this thing is like limping away from me. That is horrific. And it's very strong too. I'm stronger. Dusky grouper. Wonder if it's called, if we called autumn fall because of the falling temperatures. Wouldn't it surprise me? I don't know. I don't know how things are named. Oh, I am almost overloaded. I gave you a French person vibe. <laughs> I wonder why. I don't know much about the French. Um, all I know, like my only frame of reference is media and I know they don't portray any group of people accurately. I think that the way um, Japanese anime, like, or even media in general portrays human, um, not humans. I looked at the shark and I was like, human. Uh, Americans is hilarious. It's like the burgers and the guns and hot dogs and stuff. And everybody in America has a Southern accent and it, you know? <laughs> Okay, they are all tuna. All right, that makes more sense. Although, oh, hi, Dr. Bacon. I do like me some burgers though, and some hot dogs. I can't deny it. Twitter ain't nice to French people because of, uh, because of things. Wait a minute, I didn't, I didn't know Twitter was going after the French right now. Or California or Florida. It used to be New York. Oh yeah, they do do. They do like to make fun of the Valley Girls. Hi Ninja, welcome in. Huh, see people artifact. Hmm, very interesting. Well, I'm glad you like it. I'll have to analyze this artifact in the mural further at my lab. I'll be in touch soon. Goodbye, Dr. Bacon. A pleasure to have a fellow scientist on stream. Wait. Hello? Oh, shit. Environmentalists. John Watson. Well, if that's not an American name, I don't know what is. Hey, you there. I heard an explosion in the sea. Do you know what's going on? Oh, about that. Um... We are Sea Blue. We are an organization that tracks down people who pollute this beautiful sea and reports them. Sometimes carry out justice myself for those that commit particularly evil deeds. 
Woof, dude. I've had reports of someone who has been engaging in mindless destruction of the environment in these parts. I don't know if it was you, but you better be aware of this. Whoever harms the Great Sea will have to contend with Sea Blue. And me, John Watson. Now then, be ever grateful to the sea and never lose your love for it. I'll be leaving now. We're watching you. <laughs> he did the points to his eyes, points to, to Dave thing. Wow. What a creepy dude. Will we be okay? Sea Blue, that group is infamous. They commit acts of violence under the pretext of environmental protection. It's mostly the large corporations with fishing businesses, not the small fisheries that harm the environment most. Say nothing to the corporations, however. Expect they're taking bribes or something unsavory like that. That guy looked like bad news. Won't do you any good to be on their radar. Be careful. Speaking of French, the new Archon quest in Genshin Impact is the French Revolution. That actually does not surprise me at all. Um, considering that a lot of Inazuma's storyline was about uh, Japanese isolationism and um, not allowing foreigners in. So it doesn't surprise me that they're taking uh, history from actual world events and putting it in Genshin. Yeah, send me and you'll fight him. <laughs> Love OG Gundam. They gave the American Gundam boxing gloves. Are Americans known for boxing too? Uh-oh. VIP appeared. Vincent the Gourmet. Hello, viewers. This is Yui from the TV show Star, the Chef. Today, I've come to a seaside sushi bar that's all the rage on Cooksta, Bancho Sushi. In this sushi bar that's famous for its exotic sushi, we have with us the legendary sushi expert, Vincent Yamaoka. Ahem, I am Vincent Yamaoka. Hello, Vincent. How would you define sushi? Sushi is a very simple dish. There's only rice, vinegar, wasabi, and the fish that goes on top. Everything hangs upon these ing ingredients. However, simple does not mean easy. Listen, how good the ingredients are, how they were stored and aged, how they were cut, how the rice was cooked, and how it was molded. All these things matter in the art of sushi, yes. I see. In that case, what do you think of the exotic sushi that Bonko su Bancho Sushi is famous for? The ingredients for sushi have long been similar. The king of fish, the tuna, and particularly the belly. Below that, the olive flounder and amberjack with wet, wet, wet and right meat. All verified ingredients, you understand. Jadira used the new ingredients, despite the many proven ones that existed from the Edo era. Regardless of the taste, this shows a lack of respect. You have once criticized California rolls as not being real sushi. We're curious to see what your opinion on Bancho Sushi will be. Now then, let's start by introducing the star of today's show. This is the owner, Boncho. Why are we suddenly in a TV show? That seems rather rude. Don't we have to sign contracts for this? Don't we have to set up a, a deal of payment and things like that? This seems a bit illegal. It's Florida wildlife. You'll save your wishes for Napoleon. Okay, but the character demo and a uh, character... Um, Oh god, MV for Farina were really fun. He's quite reticent. This means he can only speak through his cooking. This sushi bar offers a fantastic view as it's near the giant blue hole, and the chef sure gives off the vibes of a master. I'm really looking forward to how the food will taste. Vincent, which food will you be trying? I'm not really interested in the food of a place that's so focused on appearances. You there, Boncho, was it? Your name. Let me take a look at what you can do. Let me see. Bring me something to surprise me. Wow, Vincent offers a daring provocation. He left the menu for the chef to decide. I can't just sit by and listen to your prejudice thinking. Give me two days, I'll be sure to shock you. A standoff between a traditional gourmet and an exotic chef. Things are getting real interesting. We'll come to you live on the next episode. Don't forget to tune in next time to Star the Chef. Was that a was that TV personality enough? 
<laughs> She's so slay. The BBC wants money, not volunteer. <laughs> Blue hole. <laughs> what are you thinking? What are you gonna do? A man does not run from a challenge. I've thought of something. Will you get me the ingredients? I need some sea grapes and white spotted jellyfish. They can both be harvested in the limestone cave about 100 meters down in the depths. Hmm, you're gonna make sushi with those? Okay. The limestone cave, right? I'll go look for them. I just think I already have them. Sometimes the VIP customer will order a dish that's not on the menu. Procure the ingredients by the designated date. I think I already have them. I don't have the white spotted jellyfish. Damn. I must have used it all for the jellyfish party. So wait, hold up. We have the big tuna event and the VIP on the same day? How is that gonna work? All right, let's uh, put out an ad. We're gonna, we're gonna hire a, uh... I can always train them higher than the current cook star rating, but I don't know if I'll be able to afford them. So we'll just go current uh, cook star rating. We'll see if I can get it good. This is like clickbait for the Discovery Channel. Hiring has begun. All right, ingredients. Did I get new things? I don't think I did. Interior. Oh, yeah, let me clear. I have red dot syndrome. I cannot stand when there are red dots on the screen. Oh, are we not decorating for Halloween? Just Christmas? All right. But Halloween. Yeah, I don't have enough to do that. All right, let's prep today's menu. Oh no, now I'm talking like her. Ah! <laughs> All right, everyone, for today's menu, we're gonna choose a variety of expensive fish. We don't want to keep people feeling like they're cheap here and we're trying to make a profit. What is Halloween? There is only Christmas. No. Okay, so let's see. <laughs> oh, okay. So we've got some pretty expensive ones here. Um, let's put five of those. Now it's time for spoofy? What is spoofy? All right, cuttlefish will be our more middling option. And then we've got... Okay, I get the feeling I don't want to use that. Not right now. Oh. Wow, triggerfish is expensive. Well, actually, you know what? Let's put the $50 one on there. Let's see if we can make it sell. And then we'll do some great barracuda sushi. Ooh, barracuda. <laughs> Three of those. And I don't wanna, do I wanna eat? Mm -hmm. It's so hard to decide what to put on the menu. I've got all these cheap fish, but we're well past cheap fish. I've got some white tip reef shark sushi, sushi still. Sure. Okay, so let's make our lowest one 24. Or 20. Not go any lower than that. Oh, I have so much white trevally. Let's do that. Okay, 5, 9, 14, 17, 21, 25. We got room for one more. Well, we have 25 customers. Let's just prep if we're gonna have, as if we're gonna have 30 customers. Let's prepare for a chaotic night. I might need to, might need to go down on my price a little. I don't want to. 
really gonna have to focus on those more expensive fish. I mean, we've got 30. Let's put three of these on there. All right, 20, 20, 22, 24, 30, 30, and 51. All right, let's go. The sushi, mukbang. Thanksgiving the mucking hall. <laughs> I see what you meant. Um, wonder if the sushi guy Fieri will show up. Probably, because Thanksgiving gets treated like a joke. It does. Everybody just skips over Thanksgiving. Nonstop E in November. Mostly Sunday. <laughs> Twilight being spicy with the menu tonight. Yeah, I'm sorry. <clears throat> We're trying to run a fine establishment. We can't have the pores in our building. Can I sell the cheap fish outside the restaurant? I probably will be able to. I need to look at it. Get some money for my waste fish that I'm never going to put back on the menu because, as I said, we're a fine establishment. We don't cater to the pores here. All right. What's up with my phone? Oh, I got a new fish, right. <laughs> you know it's true. People have that attitude. All right. -bum 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 -bum. Okay. Okay, you got her? No, 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 no. You start serving. You're faster than me. There we go. Perfect. All right. We do have a lot of people. Dishes, dishes, dishes are being taken care of. All right. We got our runners back and forth. Everybody's doing well. Good, good. Nope. There we go, we got wasabi. Dishes to get, dishes to get. Tea. Eh, shit, sorry. My bad. Oh, let's get these. Oh. There we go. I think we're caught up, all right. All right, wasabi is good. Everybody good? Oh, we're out of fish. Um. It actually, did I have exactly enough fish for people? Hell yeah, we sold everything. Nice, we almost sold a thousand in fish. Let's go. Okay. Top sales was the Agar Toro Tokoroten. And very nice. Has anyone played Overcooked? I have not, but I want to. <laughs> no peasants. Sushi Gordon Ramsay will ask where's the lamb sauce? <laughs> well, they could always ask where's the eel sauce. Oh my god, I fucking love eel sauce. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Oh god! Did he just get his wife kidnapped? Was that his wife? Or was that like a sister? I don't know. That bitch was just kidnapped by a giant eel. Huh, Dave. Yes, Dr. Bacon. Dave. Yes. Do you want to hear the good news or the bad news? The good news? <laughs> You're the positive type. I studied the bracelet you brought me a lot. <laughs> I studied the bracelet you brought me lot yesterday. It was from the sea people as I expected. Wow, so it is an ancient artifact. A bracelet seems to be imbued with a mysterious power. Here, you can wear this. 
Is he making me be the guinea pig for this bracelet? What? Me? I mean, I'm grateful, but why? <laughs> Who knows? There might be some frightening sea people curse on it. Well, in any case, try it on first. Uh, no? No? A bracelet-shaped sea people artifact has a mysterious energy that aids breathing. All right. Breathing. Yep. Wow, I feel some kind of new... <laughs> Shut up! I feel some kind of new power inside me. I, I slipped up okay! <laughs> Glad to hear nothing bad happened. You should be able to check your diver box for more information about the charm you're wearing. <laughs> oh, and I have more great news. I've analyzed the artifacts and investigation data. I was able to find a very strong signal in these ocean depths. That was the right place. The objects didn't just float over here. I have a feeling a giant blue hole that suddenly appeared is serving as a conduit to a sea people site. A very lucky opportunity. It just sounds like I have to risk my life again. So what's the bad news? Mm, in order to venture deep, you'll need a deep sea headlamp. Deliveries have stopped right now for some reason, so getting one is out of the question. Maybe Duff will have one? He has all sorts of things. Hmm, you're right. Try contacting Duff first, will you? Welcome in, Inochi. Duff's pink delivery? You can equip charms and swap them out in the inventory. Alright, cool. Where's the inventory? Management? Diver box. All right. Hmm. All right. Cook stuff. You can eat well and still lose weight. All right. Fine. What is my next rank up? Wow. Quite a bit. She could stay for the whole stream of the puppy as a rambunctious rock. You gotta go walk him to calm him down. Have a good walk. I'm sure he'll enjoy it. Puppies have so much energy. Until they don't. And then they just flop on the floor for a bit. So cute. Wait, I can't... I can't sell the fish. I can sell some silver bowls, though. A foot bone oh okay okay <laughs> got a little confused for a moment i'm very concerned all right i guess i called duff ah why are you so angry duff i ordered a limited edition leah chan figurine but it hasn't come in for over a week would you believe it it's got a serial number and a limited edition only art book oh calm down a bit everyone seems upset with the deliveries having stopped I think there must have been some kind of accident. Mm. To see what's going on, I'll need the deep sea headlamp. Okay. Oh, well, of course I have one of those in my storage, my safe storage, yeah. but I can't give it to you for free. There's a condition. Yeah. I think I know what's coming. Yeah. Leave's fine, my Leah's Chan figurine. Yeah. It's in a pink delivery box. You'll know it when you see it. Yeah. I request a special care for the package so it should, show it's a <laughs> so it should not have been washed away. Yeah. If the ship carrying it sank, it's likely to be somewhere nearby. Find it for me and I'll give you the deep sea headlamp. <laughs> I have to first find the location of the sunken transport ship. That's hilarious. We, he can't be without his waifu. We have to rescue her. Do the diver series that become some of your favorites to watch. Oh, clipped it, Ninja. Why? Welcome in, Conway. Yeah, sushi. Wait, 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 wait. I need to shop. I need another one of these. There we go. Now we're good for the rest of the day. He needs his waifu to save his laifu. She's miserable alone. You don't understand. So lonely and scared in that box. Oh, throat noises. <laughs> A gotcha obsessed Ash Ketchum and an anime figurine obsessed weave in this game. Yeah, it, it knows its target audience, I feel. Hmm? I hear loud noises from over there. 
should go check things out. No, no, you shouldn't. I need to catch. Damn it. What is with these dolphins? Are you not smart enough to avoid the surface? Hey, why do you keep bothering these dolphins? Because so you're the one who keeps interrupting our plans. I can tell just by your silhouette. You need to be taught a lesson. You better be ready. Oof, I was just looking to scare them. Oh, well, I'll have to see if I can defeat them. Am I going to shoot some motherfuckers? Oh, my God. We're in a deep... We're in an underwater gunfight right now. Let's teach the pirates a lesson first. I am trying to put distance between us, you idiot. Okay, harpoon time or knife time. Okay, I think I got him. Holy shit, we just murdered people. Hi, Kuro. Ugh, we're retreating for the day. You'll hear from us again. <laughs> yeah, Ipapa! Welcome in, Kuro, to fucking murder! I have no idea what this game is. I mean, we saved the dolphins, but now we're a criminal. So I don't... I mean, it's a pretty dolphin. I guess they aren't going to report us. Are you giving me another pearl? This pirates had stormtrooper aim. No, I was just too good. They were pirates, so it balances out. A rusty dolphin necklace. Imagine those dolphins narc on you. How they wouldn't. I just saved their lives. Well, one of their lives. I don't think they want the, the gray one, honestly. The pink one is important. Imagine if the mission was to kill the dolphins instead. Oh god, like we have to old yeller one of them? That would be terrible. They swam away all peaceful and such. Yeah, but like with critical injuries. <laughs> all right, bye, you know, cheat. Not the dolphins. Well, something like an old charm. Should identify it later. All right, time to capture some. I know there are tuna that swim around here. There they are. Okay. Ow! So, right here. And, whoops, voila, another tuna. Okay, so I'm supposed to find where the shipwreck is, but do I even know? We have to rescue that guy's waifu. Ammunition, just in case, cool. Yes, oxygen. But I also need to catch some good fish along the way. So when I get down into the limestone cavern, we need to catch that jellyfish. And then we won't have to stress about that. But I need good fish. Like you. So I do know that the shipwreck won't be deep in the dark water because we can't traverse here because we don't have the headlamp. So that, I don't think we're gonna be able to go any further, much further here. So we're in this stream, you've discovered an ancient mermaid species, overlooked a giant tentacle monster, got boycotted by environmentalists and fought pirates. It's, it's, it's one of the games of all time. <laughs> I'm having fun. Ooh, Barracuda. I'm having so much fun with this game. I can see why people keep playing it. Oxygen, yes. My friend got me for this for me for my birthday and I'm, I'm very thankful. I'm having a lot of fun with it. All right, we'll get some of this oxygen just in case I get attacked. Oh, 
Shipwreck. Imagine that. We found the pink box. There, my precious Leah's Chan. Bring it to me quick. Finish your mission. Oh, she's a bunny girl. Um. I guess, uh, the... I guess the giant squid is a simp? What was that just now? My Leah's Chan. She disappeared into the unfathomable depths. She appears to have been some giant life form. Please go and retrieve her. What the fuck, dude? Wait, that obviously looks dangerous. Besides, the lock, the doors on the ship are all locked and I can't go inside. Do you really think I didn't think of that before concocting Leah Chan's rescue plan? I provide you with my secret weapon. The gas cutter. Even at this moment, Leah's Chan awaits her master. Ugh. Sir? Sir? Please, no. Sir? No. No, no. No, no. Come to the boat, will you? This guy is incorrigible. Incorrigible. Ew, no. I didn't need to be introduced to his secret waifu fantasy. He needed to keep that shit to himself. You think you heard of the sentai tentacles and anime go hand in hand? They do. Now that you mention it, I bet they planned for that. All right, we found the limestone cave. <laughs> He's a Discord mod. Leah Chan's is his Discord. Uh, Leah's Chan is his Discord kitten. Okay, so there should be jellyfish here that I need to find. Ooh, tranquilizer harpoon tip. Very nice. And more ingredients. Zach, welcome in. Hello. What are you hearing? You just missed something very interesting. So we need to... So this guy is supposed to... Whoa, shit. I need these jellyfish. This guy is supposed to help us reach depths with a headlamp. And instead, he was like, no, you have to rescue my anime waifu figurine. And then the anime waifu figurine got stolen by a giant uh, squid octopus looking thing. Oh no, I didn't want to... I can trank them. I just got another three star. Let's go. Oh, that's exciting. I can get three star fish this way. I don't want to waste it all on jellyfish. Let's go. Yes. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. I need this fish. Yes! Three-star anglerfish! Let's go! Oh! A clam? No, 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 no. Stop blowing me. Stop blowing me. Hey! Okay, I'll get this first. A golf club. <laughs> okay, we'll have to wait. Are you sure she's a figurine? She might be an actual bunny girl. A small, small bunny girl in a box? That would be different. Oh, it's oxygen. All right, well. Don't make the joke, don't make the joke. Yeah, I knew, I knew when I said it, but you know what, here we are. Yoink. <laughs> you actually use it like a... Oh, I love it. All right, we'll take this oxygen with us because we're not coming back. Is the box the new jar? No, don't do that to me. Oh, we need to get back up. 
we are running out of carrying space but we got everything that we needed let's just add some sea graves for good measure didn't figure that'd be too heavy oh god ah! all right i've got plenty plenty of oxygen to just keep going all the way straight up And I guess if I run out of oxygen, I do have the Sea People bracelet that will help me survive. Lovely. Wonderful. Brilliant. Move, bitch. Get out the way. Yes, way we're Turn to the boat. Do I love a shark, shark slayer? Not right now, I'm not. <laughs> you know what? You, 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 you. <laughs> There's a different Sonic still having trouble calming down just like Leah's chun did when she first came face to face with Fenrir okay. since you found the location I'll reward you for it I do like to do honest dealings yeah. now then let's begin the Leah's chun rescue mission take this gas cutter yeah. you'll see a spot that can be cut into when you reach the ship there will be a button prompt yeah. cut the weak point in the iron door and you'll be able to enter the ship yeah. just retrieve the pink delivery box that has Leah's chun from inside the ship should be simpler than you'd think yeah. I saw a huge tentacle taking the ship. It looks extremely dangerous. Do you mean to say it's okay for Leah's chant to expire in the dis darkness down there? This mission must not be delayed for a moment longer. Oh, all right, I get it. Well, I'll try going down there. Leah's chan rescue mission. I feel like I caught some good fish. Yes, I did. All right. We'll need to catch more fish. That is not enough but we'll have to make do Ooh, a dolphin charm that is after helping out a dolphin cu couple increases dash speed by 30 percent. that's nice but i don't know yeah oxygen will be used up faster i'm good that seems like a way to end up in trouble yay i got five star fish let's go all by my lonesome dive your famous vtuber merch is lost to the hentai creature if anything you'd think that this would be like i don't know maybe he just doesn't want to think of anyone else with his leas chan wait where's my other ow oh. No more tuna? Yeah, there are tuna. Why couldn't I? What happened to my other bomb? My other net? I bought more. All right, whatever. That doesn't make any sense to me. We're going down, down, down. <laughs> all right guess the net wasn't equipped but it, it's supposed to switch in and out i don't i don't know maybe i did fuck up okay and then it was to the left yeah here we go there will be a button prompt there is in fact a button prompt this must be the door let's try using the gas cutter from duff turn on the cutter and use l to move keep your movements inside the circle whoa mini game okay it is like the controller is going crazy in my hands right now huh perfect 
perfect. Oh, I was in too much of a hurry to properly tell you how to use it, but you figured it out. Go in through the open door now. Yes, Chan, your master is coming. No comment. Oh, no. No, I don't. I need to catch fish first. That's no good. That's no good at all. I need to catch things. I have a business to run. Do we have a line? Duff, we have a line in this household. Yes, we do. Ow. We do indeed. And he is very close to crossing it. So uncomfy. Whoops! Well, it didn't disintegrate. Didn't even realize I'd switched to the gun. Wait, how do I use this? Oh, okay. I see how. It just shocked the other fish. Oh no, little guy. I'll mercy kill you, don't worry. Ooh, and more oxygen. Good, that's useful. Maybe get this cuttlefish? Might be one of those fancy Adam and Eve figurines. <laughs> oh no. This mini game reminds me of a DS mini game. It's cute. There's so many different ways to, like there's so many different things that they put in this game. It's a lot of fun. I didn't evaporate the fish. The fish is fine. I mean, it's dead now, but it wasn't, it didn't disintegrate into a million little particles. I do keep electrifying fish in the area though, so that's pretty funny. Rather odd, but funny. All right, I'm gonna get this one last coral trout and then we'll go back down. Cool. Oh no, I'm overloaded. I'm overweight. Shit, okay, what do we want to dump? Okay. Oh no. Okay. Um If I dump the clown frog fish and the salt and the silver bowl, we'll be at weight. Okay. Oxygen. Remind you not to get shocked. You don't want to get mercy killed by Twyla. You're not a fish though. You're not a fish. I can't eat you. I mean, I can, but I'm not going to. Has four slain arrows, Star Wars. God damn it. I mean, once I go in, I can't come back out. So let's just, yeah. Should have saved that other oxygen. That was my mistake. Surely a full tank of oxygen will be enough to last me in here. You're a meatloaf, you're very edible. Oh no! Oh, great thing we don't die like by electricity like in real life. Have unlimited power. Someone being extra creepy about a figurine of an anime waifu, yeah. Got mods here to bonk back over the line. 
<laughs> get Doge in here too, just bunk bunk. Give me that. Huh, this face looks seems larger than expected. Take a look around, Dave. The blinking red number in the corner. The bottom left corner is the amount of weight I can carry. Um, oh, there is oxygen down here. And I can replenish my uh, ammo that I accidentally shot a fish with. You gonna give me a better nu uh, better gun? Gun enhancement kit. Yay. I get the feeling they are telling me I'm gonna need a gun. Hi, Ken. Welcome in. Yes, more oxygen. What kind of battle am I facing? Like, they've given me two oxygen tanks, an additional oxygen tank. Well, we found the giant squid, everybody. Well, giant octopus, everybody. It is a giant squid. We found the giant squid, everybody. There it is. The pink delivery box with Leah's chan inside. Wait, more importantly, look at that giant squid. So that's our culprit. I guess it knows a good thing when it sees it. Even if it is just a squid. Seems to be asleep. Sneak up and bring it back quietly. Uh, I've come back too far to go back empty-handed. Guess I'll try approaching quietly. Well, that didn't work. Giant squid! It's awake. I need to get back. Dave, don't tell me you're going to chicken out. Here's the gun I gave you. The harpoon will be of no use. Yes, Chun. Here we come. Oh my god. Ow. I have to actually defeat it. I'm almost out of weapons. Oh no, I'm almost out of bullets. Okay, there's ammunition here. Ow, that was dumb. she's gonna die save her wait were those sea people just now huh what do you mean all i can see is the pink delivery box bring it back quickly it's a waiting rescue telling him won't do any good i'll have to go up and tell dr bacon Hmm, box is pinned under a squid tentacle. Have to cut it anyway. Wonder if it's edible. Should try taking it back to Boncho. Well, uh, did we actually kill the giant squid? I guess so. But I thought that was one of the big, like, I didn't expect to. Wow. My expectations have been exceeded. I did not think we were going to figure out the secret of the giant squid for longer. Yes, that's the one. Come back up to the boat. So relieved. Yes, John. Giant's good is still alive in your heart. 
Oh, you could just imagine that those environmentalist assholes are going to be like... Okay, she's cute though, and look at those thighs. And actually, um, on the base of it, it does say Riasu. Uh, Ria so yeah, Lias. <laughs> Fun. To think she hasn't been damaged. Oh, there's salt water everywhere. I'll clean you up. Here comes Elias. Okay. Whoops, I said Elias chance line by accident, though I'm the master. <laughs> In any case, a promise is a promise. Here you are, the deep sea headlamp. It's a recent model. That turns on automatically as necessary. I must go help Elias chan recover. Good by eternity. It's fine. It's fine. Fine. Uh, <laughs> oh, I guess that's over for now. Come to think of it, I did bring this. What will I do with this giant squid tentacle? It smells so awful. I'm not sure it can be used to cook with. I have to give Boncho a call. A call? I mean, we're about to see him. I'll call just in case. Leah Chan, come to master. <laughs> Definitely a Vocaloid figure, and that felt gross. There's the line, and he passed it. Yeah, he, I mean, do what you will with your, your anime waifu and your dakimakuras and things like that. In the privacy of your own home. When you force it on other people, that's when it gets weird. What is it, Dave? I was helping Duff, and I defeated a giant squid. That's incredible. I couldn't bring the whole thing, so I cut off a bit of its tentacle. Is this edible, perhaps? Hmm, of course. The ammonium chloride that helps it float gives it an awful stench, however. Because it's very tough, it's difficult to cook using conventional methods. I don't think we'll be able to offer it to our customers anyway. Why don't we close up shop for the day and hold a party with the squid? I've been so busy since we opened that I haven't treated you to any proper food, despite your hard work. Oh, that sounds fantastic. Yay! Let me clean up a bit. Come to the sushi bar when you're ready. Dr. Bacon will be there as well, so I can tell him about the fish people I saw. Hey! We don't have to work tonight! Party! Good thing it was the day before our big event. <laughs> Dave, you're a bit late. Everyone's been waiting for you. Wow, you finished all the cooking already. When did everyone arrive, though? What do you mean I can't talk to the cat? Unforgivable. Zero out of ten. Party with customers. There's been a lot of progress. Very good. Has there? Restaurants should put their customers first. Food, drink, service, and customers are the basic foundations of a restaurant. In the past, there was only a rigorous chef in his cooking. Uh, I was also here from the beginning. Yes, but you weren't very noticeable. Wow. Do you remember what I told you back then about the reviews on Cooksta? You said there wasn't any real mention of me. But now people do mention you, albeit rarely. They say things like, he poured me hot green tea. He was working hard preparing the wasabi. He was friendly. He looked busy. Oh, the customers are recognizing your hard work. Well, that makes me feel good. Customers are honest and intuitive, more so than you think. They know if you're sincere, kind, diligent, or skilled, and they react accordingly. That's why I find this moment hard to believe. To think that obstinate Boncho is working with people and holding parties. It's thanks to you, Dave. Makes me wonder what he was like in the past. I can't divulge details about someone else's past, but maybe someday, if the opportunity presents itself, I might be able to tell you. Maybe someday, when I'm drunk to my ass on sake, the past will come out. The cat is too busy to speak. Oh, she just called me invisible. Yeah, I guess I'll accept that. <laughs> Dave, congratulations. Word of Boncho Sushi's now getting around. He looks to be in a very good mood. Look at this squid tentacle. It's the sort of thing you dream of eating as a child, is it? I bet more people flock here if such things are offered on the menu. 
Aren't we eating this because it's difficult to serve to customers, though? You're right. What a pity. Everyone will want to try something that looks like this, regardless of the flavor. Regardless of the flavor, you say? There's no way Boncho could stomach that. Let's go with something else. All right, about the depths. I have a feeling things must be down there. Things that'll make people jump out of their seats. If Dr. Bacon's research is successful, this place will be filled and famous and filled with people. Hmm, you're right. When that happens, we'll make tons of money. So keep at it, Dave. Let's get rich together. <laughs> it's all about the money. Sake is how the dark truth comes out for you, a gallon of rum. I have a stupidly high tolerance for rum of all things. Like my friend and I polished off three quarters of a bottle of um, spiced app, uh, rum apple cider. I did not feel it. I don't know why. Rum does not get to me like other things. And I have, I don't know. It was kind of funny. I mean, I didn't have a hangover from drinking that much rum. But also how? Uh, Dr. Bacon? Oh, Dave, what is it? I saw the sea people down below. You what? You really saw sea people and not dugongs? What did they look like? Were they dressed? Do they resemble humans? Uh, their torsos look like our own, but the sights of me scared them off into the depths. Couldn't get a good look. That's too bad. It could have been an amazing find. That means we might encounter them in the depths. That's where the signal is strongest. Perhaps there's even a village. A village? Yes, they have artifacts, murals, a language. They are beings with a unique civilization. It would not be surprising in the least for them to live in a village of sorts. That would be quite the fine indeed. An ancient civilization under the sea could be revealed to us. Dave, you're my best hope. Keep up the good work. What did I eat before drinking? Given that it was at my friend's house, probably something really good and hearty. But I've also been at that same friend's house and also eaten things that were just as good and hearty and come out a lot worse. <laughs> Twyla, who was worse? Crazy Tracy from Link's Awakening or Duff? Definitely Duff. Absolutely Duff. <laughs> Tracy was a bit of a flirt. And I mean, it might have just been the, the, the models. I mean, Link might have been old enough, but. Um. Duff, Duff just shoves his stuff in everybody's business, and I'm not sure I'm okay with that. Drank a straight gallon by yourself alone. It took a lot of resilience, and you puking up half your guts. Oh, dear. Giant squid tentacle. It really is an ingredient that's difficult to handle. Suppressing the stench should allow me to reach its essence. You're still studying the ingredients. Good work today, bringing back precious ingredients. This is a difficult sort to prepare, but that's part of the fun of cooking. So how does it taste? The food's always been great, but today's is even more spectacular. Since there was a lot of it, I made many different dishes, though we won't be able to offer these to customers. There seems to be no end to the path of a chef. It is a fortunate thing to have a path to pursue. The same can be said of the study of ingredients, Dave. Please keep persevering and one day we'll succeed. I'm not sure what you mean, but... Sure, I'll be bre I'll be sure to bring back more fish. Pick up beer. Ah, let's go. Hi, El Perito. How are you? Um, ¿cómo está? <laughs> That's probably why you ate some burger and stuff, drank half a bottle of vodka and felt nothing. Oh my god. I think vodka would be a lot worse for me. Whew, that's good stuff. Boncho's food is so nice. I can understand the growing popularity of the restaurant. Or maybe it's because I caught the fish? In any case, there's been a lot of stuff going on. A giant squid, sea people. There's no end to the mysteries of the ocean, even if it's dangerous. Suppose I'll go even deeper tomorrow. Wonder what I'll find. Eh, uh, whatever. I'll think about that tomorrow. Time to toast everyone and rest. <laughs> oh no, not at all. Oh wait, what is happening here? Are we about to get murdered? 
You're never late to a stream. It's whenever you can get here. Insides must have smelled like a hospital with that much vodka. <laughs> Did you hear? Okay, I just saw a Hank Green video, right? About how they occasionally find bugs in people's colons. That's horrifying. That is terrifying. I don't want bugs in my ass. Good morning. I must have drank too much yesterday. I feel sick. You did seem a bit excited. <laughs> you get to, don't get gatherings like that every day. That sort of occasion calls for joviality. You can't throw up here, Dr. Bacon. I mean, it is the ocean. What's going to happen? It's just going to be in the ocean. I'm not the drinker I used to be. In any case, take the deep sea headlamp Duff gave you and try venturing down into the depths. It'll probably turn on automatically when you reach the right depth. Don't forget, you have to enhance your diving suit if you want to venture into the depths. I'll have to enhance my equipment first then. By the way, do you happen to have scuba? Ew! That was some fucking poltergeist shit. Now it's getting me under the water after that. I mean, there's worse things in the ocean. Let's be real. It's party day today. Prepare the right ingredients and make a fortune. But I feel like I did just update my equipment. He just gave their fish the food. Yeah. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to, I'm not going to like that. I like Boncho sushis. <laughs> Yoshi is this funny. Yep. I don't just want to seem like we're in it for the money, you know? Even if he is. I feel like we need to keep some... I need to keep some semblance of uh, not just being for the money. Mail. A giant crocodile in the sewer. Hello, this is Movie Wonder. The weather's getting a bit chilly. How about a creepy horror movie? What if a giant mutant crocodile appeared in the sewer? Experience realistic horror on the big screen. Wait, what else did I get? What did I get that's new? Did I get something the new? Oh, no, I didn't. All right, music. We got new music. Oh, nice. Yeah, colon bugs. So apparently, um, it is possible for people to just eat bugs. And when people go in for colonoscopies, when they put cameras there, you can just occasionally see a bug. Uh, someone found like a dead cockroach in, in a butt. But the one that really freaked people out was the fact that someone had drunk the colon cleanse so quickly that the ladybug just passed right through the digestive tract without getting dissolved. And so they found a live ladybug up someone's butt. Cobra is going to turn from Mr. Krabs from SpongeBob. Money, money, money. Why is it still moving? Yeah, can you imagine? Okay, imagine pulling up. I don't want to spend all that much money. I think I've got enough. I think I've got enough for the depth limit. Um, imagine looking at the camera. And you just see a live ladybug. Like, can you imagine how horrifying that would be? I hate it. 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 <laughs> I absolutely hate it. You wake up in the fucked up timeline. I mean, it makes sense. Anything crawling in your ass is horrifying. Yep. And now you have to live with this knowledge just like I do. Oh my God. What else can happen today? Oh, it's John Watson. So it was you, the one who's been harming the ocean. You even vomited, you disgusting creature. You do realize 
Whales come in the ocean, right? Fish die in the ocean. It, 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 there's worse things. There's worse things than puke. Wait, that wasn't me. It was... I have no time for your petty excuses. Now that you've been caught by John Watson of Sea Blue, the guardians of the sea, you won't be leaving so easily. I'll turn you into fish food. What are you doing? Oh, my Poseidon. This is all your fault. You did this to the precious sea. You're the one shooting bombs? All I do is catch a few fish to keep the restaurant running. Why don't you look into the fishing vessels res vessels responsible for catching thousands of fish, not individual divers like me? Ha! <laughs> Enough flabbing. I'll shut that yapper of yours. Here goes. I was not expecting boss battles in this game. I don't know how much these will hurt if I get... Oh! Ow. You know what? You get the gun. Oh man, my guns. Did he just power up? Ow. Oh no. I think I'm gonna die. Okay, and then another round. Okay, I think I got him. How dare you fight back against me? John Watson, formerly of the Navy SEALs. That should serve as an adequate warning. So I'll back away for now to protect the environment. And I won't let you go unpunished if you persist in damaging the sea. We're watching you. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? The cognitive dissonance is incredible. Human-sized enemies are the best enemies, yeah? Sure, whales are allowed to do it. You need to stop drinking water while Twilight saying absolutely wild things. <laughs> Never use logic on an environmentalist. It's actually pretty weird when whales do it. It's come worse than vomit. I feel they're about the same. That was the point I was making. Does it really matter? Ninja puts both out the same. <laughs> what? Damn. A path has opened up in the direction of John Watson escape. Let's go that way to reach the signal. Uh, I need oxygen. Please tell me there's oxygen down here. I would like to not die. Okay. Wait, I never got the... I didn't get the tuna. Oh no. Okay, we're just gonna. Boo. Fuck you, John Watson. I had a party to prepare for. Of course he was a Navy SEAL. Oh, hi, Ash Ketchum. Yowie. Uh, um, you seem energetic today. I saw a boss card acquisition notification pop up on your Marine card account. It's this giant squid boss card. How did you get this? It's such a rare card. 
Uh, well, I was on my way to pick up a delivery, and as chance would have it. Okay, I don't have a clue what that means, but in any case, you've made amazing progress. Try collecting all the rare boss cards, something good sure to happen. And if you want to venture to new regions, for example, the depths, the automatic marine card AI system will unlock a new card pack. Don't forget to collect fish cards in the new regions as well. Bye then. Choo choo. All right. Well, have fun with that. Check on new fish. All right. Well, I guess I'll finally catch a... Interesting. Ah, that's where it is. Oh, it's shiny! It's a holographic, rank 99. <laughs> 50 to 130 meters. Hmm. All right, well, let's catch the tuna of the day. Dick. Man asking how you got the ultra rare pole and gotcha. I'm just that cracked. I think it's more, it pops up on, like, it acknowledges that you got a thing, and then it's a digital card. Logan Paul's Charizard. I forgot about that. Wait. These dicks took my net from me. And I wasn't able to get another one. These pieces of shit. Whoops. Wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Can you almost guarantee it costs more? It would not surprise me. Paying millions for Pokemon cards. Yeah. Wish I'd gotten in on it back then. I have an E3 Pikachu from like the extras that they just shoved in Nintendo Power and were like, here, take them. Right, live net gun. Yay! Cool. And then I'll get my shotgun back. <laughs> but I will use the harpoon. Tyler's pulling out all the stops today. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm in a I'm in a weird mood. I'm just having fun. I need some oxygen. Oxygen would be great. What? There are sharks everywhere! I'll catch the barracuda. Is that a whale shark? Surely not. Yeah, I'm a bit irritated that they cost me my net. Oh my god, that is an angry shark. Is that a... That's not a great white. If it was a great white, it would have a white fin. No, wait, that's not how it works. They are way bigger, but I didn't know if they were, like, shrinking down for the game itself. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah! I'm dead. Holy shit. A 
tiger shark. Okay. I I've, I've seen whale sharks IRL um in the the Georgia Zoo or er, Georgia Aquarium. No, they're just white. I'm mixing up my sharks. If I need oxygen, I just need to breathe. So that would not be so easy underwater. Only good when limited and wanted. You're not going to make a house fame with them. I know. Well, I got some fish. Hmm. All right. Party time. All right. Looks like I might be going for Carolina. Because John D has terrible cooking skills. And that's okay. Yay, new cards. They're so pretty and shiny. Wait, what else do I have? Oh, weapon shop. All right, I just need to keep finding things underwater so he can build them, I guess. Just flip the shark. Ah. Uh. Hello, viewers. This is Yui from the Star the Chef. Now we're back at Bancho Sushi. What kind of sushi will the chef have prepared, I wonder? I prepared jellyfish sushi. Jellyfish? You mean like in cold Chinese vegetables? Did you think you could win the acknowledgement of Vincent Yamaoka while ignoring the traditional ingredients? No way! You call yourself a gourmet. Will you judge before you've even tasted it? Ah, oh, all right. Bring it over then. All right, I'll bring you one serving of jellyfish sushi. Oh my. supposed to be the one delivering it god cooking jutsu he does i love how intense he is with it <laughs> sweet caroline that is such a fun song to sing in a group with people wow so this is jellyfish the flesh is transparent the white dots are pretty as well what you made it with bunched rice you should have made sure it doesn't scatter by making gun gun con maki instead it'll dry up Hurry up and eat. It's already been seasoned. I know it can't possibly taste good, but since it's for the program, I'll try it. <laughs> it really is Food Wars light. Gotta get ready for work. More so focused on finding the cringe video. Finishing the cringe video, you can't come up with a an ending. Oh, well, good luck at work. I hope it goes well. Foodgasm. Vincent, the look on your face. This is amazing. I can taste the sea as soon as I bite into it and the jellyfish is nice and firm. And I can taste something popping inside. Could it be flying fish roe? Wait, they're bigger than that. Caviar, no, that would have killed the jellyfish flavor. Could it be? Yes, I added some sea grape below the jellyfish. Firm jellyfish flesh and sea grape, huh? This is... The sea! I taste the sea! The sea where the cal sea kelp sway. Hmm, I can't help but under admit this sushi is amazing based on a very deep understanding of the ingredients. But why is it that you use such unknown ingredients instead of the proven ones? The first reason is the taste. Jellyfish has a gentle, mild taste with a strong texture, making it a perfect match for the scent and flavor of the sea grape. The second reason is the potential. There are so many kinds of ingredients out there, insisting on only using the verified few is the same as ignoring the infinite possibilities thank you for those amazing words Boncho. now then it's time for the evaluation vincent all right let's get into the evaluation now this is the jellyfish sushi that made vincent marvel and mr Boncho who created this dish what will the score be i'll give Boncho sushi 80 points huh isn't that too low you look quite impressed while eating Listen, the sushi was excellent. The establishment lacks something, however. Aiden combines many enjoyments to think you'd only offer us green tea with this beautiful ocean in front of us. Romance. 
This place doesn't have enough romance and appreciation for the arts. That's why I'll give this place 80 points. As a side reward, however, I'll give you a refrigerator. Being able to drink cold beer from that fridge would make the score 100. It'll be perfect. Wow, as expected of you, Vincent. That was an excellent opinion. Now, how did you like Star the Chef today? We'll really be looking forward to Bancho Sushi's exotic sushi being served with beer. See you next time. This was reporter Yui. I got a thousand gold, let's go. One song you would love to do a cover of is When Can I See You Again? That one is so cute. Mr. Boncho, stop pulling stuff out of your butt. But that, isn't that critique though? Like everybody sounds so goddamn pretentious because they think that they have to use fancy formal words to be a above the ken of you and me. Like, just fucking say. <sighs> the elitism in critique is ridiculous to me. Sounds like you want a good Friday. Why would any chef have a need for such precise and skillful curing skills? I taste the sea and the, and the sea. Yeah, I got that. But it's still, my point still stands that criti um, critics love to use big words to make themselves sound smart. Customers will now sometimes order beer after their meal, pour them their drinks and create additional revenue. Oh my god, we're really learning new. We're learning new mechanics on the night of a party. Oh, Vancho, amazing. Picky Vincent acknowledged you. The tongue does not lie. Vincent has a point. Shall we try selling beer from now on? Okay. All right. Carolina! I'm nobody's inferior in both work skills and looks. <laughs> I like her confidence. <laughs> You're hired. Oh, you want to learn something? Cooking plus. Which is, I don't know what that means details oh cooking ability increases permanently all right and oh wait maybe i need to rotate you oh no can i not re like rotate them he would be a perfect cook should have put him in the kitchen dang it Oh well, this will be fine. Menu, it's party night. Time for tuna. Let's put 10 of each. All right, I accidentally put 11, but it's fine. Um. Damn, we are gonna make bank tonight. Let's go. Sea grapes, jellyfish, sushi. Wow. Let's sell that a different night. You know what? No, everybody gets... Everybody gets, uh... Whoops, did not mean to do the same one. Everybody gets tuna. There's, that's all you get. That's all you get to choose from. It's just tuna. Don't want tuna? Oh well. You shouldn't have come during a tuna party. That's right, you'll have a thousand mechanics by game end. They spoke like everyone else. People wouldn't realize that's something most people can do. Yeah, you make a good point. Critics will use a thousand words just to say they like the food. Probably remove him and then swap him. I'll look into I'll look into if that's how you do it. Um, 
I don't want remove to be I remove him from the restaurant, but we'll, we'll stick with this for now. I just don't want to risk it. $30 for beer? What? This is not, this cannot be dollars. This has to be a different currency. It has to be. If I can't get good gaming reviews, I don't trust food reviews. Everybody gets to it, even the chat. I mean, look at how tasty this looks. Oh. I want, I want sushi so bad now. But it's okay. I have some lovely chicken um, with paprika and ground cumin and... Oh my god, what's... It's not ground pepper. The red pepper. Chili. Chili powder. And it's gonna be delicious. Alright. Everybody gets tuna. You don't get a choice. Alright. Who wants what? There we go. Okay. All right, we're getting this stuff knocked out. Oh no. Oh no, this is a lot more difficult. How do I? Okay. Oh, that person didn't want tuna. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Ah! Start cooking. Dishes. Dishes. Oh, that is too low. Yeah, sorry. Oh no, someone was late. Oh well. That was rough. Wow. Well, it was like I said, if you don't want sushi, don't come for a sushi party. We just made $5,377 from the sushi party. Hell yeah. You just woke up. Welcome in, Toby. Goofy Goober dollars for this restaurant. Might be able to have some standards with food, but what's the point in breaking something down if it's not to help it improve? Yeah. I made bank. I did. I can buy so much good stuff now. Hell yeah. That was a good night. Even if someone was just like, I don't like tuna. Well, go the fuck away. This restaurant isn't for you tonight. Maybe it's time to upload, upgrade my equipment. I mean, I can now. I just got rich. The yacht party was fun. Tuna sashimi will always be the best. Too good to eat. It's just too beautiful. Went all out. Want sushi? Sushi, tuna sushi is where it's at. Oh, thank you. You we love. <laughs> cool. All right. I don't want to necessarily get all of it in the salvage drone. Let's bump up my suit a little. And my air tank. Let's get everything up to above a thousand that I have to pay out for it. There we go. Shark harpoon gun. Ha! 
Sure. Wow. Next one is a bump up for sure. Cargo box. And air tank. Everything just got considerably more expensive, so I should better start getting more food. But first... Oh no, where's your bombs, dude? I need your nets. Guess no net for me. Don't want to worry about that. All right, well... We can get so many more things now. This is named restaurant. I would like to just, I don't know. I like chill environments in restaurants above super formal, fancy type. Sixty-three kilograms of fish I can bring back now. I'm gonna go on a hunt. Common cat food. Cat food? Should I give it to Momo? The cat's name is Momo! I love it! I think that's adorable. Now that I have this new harpoon gun, I'm just like, kill all the things. Yeah, now we're just gonna cut it up. I already injured it. No, 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 just harpooned. Unless it's a shark. I probably have enough I can bring back more shark. That'll get me some ingredients. Oh, a shrimp. All right, you're expensive. Please come to me. <laughs> I think I've only shot one fish today. That's an improvement. I'm doing better. I mean, we can bring back some of these now that they're really good for business. Yeah. Let's find a shark. Whoops. I wanted this guy. I was trying to catch this guy earlier, wasn't I? And then that shark intervened. I get the feeling it's going to be expensive. And I want it. I don't like how it just looked at me like, would you stop? Sorry, can't stop, won't stop. Need to eat you. Oh, you're a giant Trevally. I guess I have already gotten one of you, haven't I? Twyla's gonna make the sushi taste better by casting the delicious spell. Oh no. <laughs> moe, moe, kyun! <laughs> the grind never stops. Hey, look, olive oil. <laughs> A shark! I got it right on the tip of its nose. Oh, we've learned how to dodge. Let's go. Oh God. We got it. 
Long nosed saw, long -nosed saw shark meat. We got two of them. Aha, good thing I do have extra. That was violent. That was kind of scary. Get this barracuda. Actually, what are these? You know what? We'll get the barracuda first because it's evil. And then I want these green guys. You look new. Harlequin Hind. Ooh, another giant trevally. Yeah, that was violent. I'm not sure if like... Her Dwai Wu, not Moe Twyla. I do not know how to. <laughs> Moe Twyla killed a shark, not clickbait. <laughs> it was trying to kill me first. The shark shot first. <laughs> That's a lie. <laughs> Okay, I do keep everything. Good. I was a little worried about that. The fish shot first in the special DVD cut. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. All right, this will be my last dive and my last uh, night cooking. Unfortunately, I do have stuff to do today after stream before brewery night. I'm only in chapter two, huh? Where am I supposed to be going? Oh yeah, 190. All right, I will follow the signal this time. I think I got enough food for tonight to cook. Down we go, down we go. Wonder how far this fish is gonna follow me. Still following, still following, bitch. No! All right. You know what? Fine. I tried to let you live. Now your food. <laughs> My client pleads, uh, nah. -uh. <laughs> My client pleads, whoops a daisy. <laughs> Isn't whoops a daisy an admission of guilt? Maybe. I actually don't know. I mean, it says you did it, but it also says you didn't mean to do it. All right. You've made a big mistake. My client was being quirky and silly. <laughs> I'm just a quirked up little white girl, that's all. Still a better defense than AI. <laughs> Oh, 
Wait, how does this work? Ah, okay. Ah, we have entered the deep sea. Two worms will shrink away from a UV light, allowing you to pass. Find a UV light in a nearby chest. If you can't find one, maybe try a melee attack. Oh, this just got really, uh... Intense. A grouper? No. Angry fish. This must be the place. Two worms are blocking the way, though. Dr. Bacon, I have two worms blocking my path. Is there a solution? Hmm, let's see. Two worms are said to hate UV light and will shrink away from it. You don't happen to have one lying around, do you? Oh, you already have one. Try shining it on them. Okay. An a lawyer used AI to try and argue a case. I have to show the video. Wow. Is she goaded with the sauce? Perked up white girl with a bit of swag, busted down sexual style. Is she goaded with the sauce? I don't know this reference, but... Oh, no. Okay. Oh, it recharges. Good. Ingredients. Black vinegar. All the way down here. Oh, that's a not. <laughs> Let's not rubber chicken the shark. Is this what I'm supposed to be doing? Is this where I'm supposed to be going? Fragment. Huh. Oh, that's a neat looking thing. There is oxygen if I need it, but I don't want to use it if I don't have... Let's open these, see if there's oxygen in them. Some minerals can only be mined with a pickaxe. Wow, feels like Final Fantasy all over again. <laughs> yeah, I'm intrigued. A sensor bomb trap. Do I want to blow things up? Do I have this for a reason? Appreciate the glowing chicken on the floor. Miso. Please tell me you're friendly. You don't look evil. Purple starfish. Sea snake whip. It, it's a living sea snake. Then creatures have a chance to be poisoned. Okay, you look friendly. Yeah, I'm not here to hurt you. to kill you yet ah I did need a pickaxe here okay but where am I going down further let's get the let's get the clam now I feel like I'm supposed to come this way oh
Is this how I blow it up? Whoops. Wait. How do I blow it up? Oh no, there's sensor bombs. Can they kill me? I may have messed up. <gasps> oh God. <laughs> Whoops. Well, that's dead. No, it's not. Oh no. Oh no, this is terrible. Go, no, 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 no. Go in the corner, go in the corner. <laughs> I was trying to blow it up. Sea toad. Okay, can I shoot it? No. Nope. And I can't set it off myself. So I guess maybe I need to leave? I feel like I'm supposed to blow this up, but I don't have what I need to blow it up. Welcome in, Seven. Yeah, Day of the Diver is interesting. We've had a lot of stuff happen today. All right, Sea Snake Whip goes away. Um, we got confronted by pirates, tried to kill some people who tried to kill us, rescued a dolphin, had a tuna party, defeated a giant squid. Opal. I do love me some opal. All right, so I don't think I can do anything more here. I think I went as far into the depths as I can. Dave, get a mermaid waifu? I mean, honestly, he should just ask uh, Duff about his anime waifus and see if he can score him one of those. Hey, tuna party is pretty rad. No, if I had the chance to just gorge on tuna sushi, I fucking would. Freaking love sushi. Tuna is really good. There's there's just so much. So much you can do with good food. All right, we're free. Uh, we'll just wait for it to recharge. Okay, we've still got plenty of oxygen. There we go. But I don't see us... Oh my god! I'm so scared of this thing. I can't harpoon it. Can't shoot it. What is with this god creature? Huh. I can't blow it up. All right, this thing just lives. That's scary. Oh, well, I got a poison tip harpoon. Maybe this will work. No? Can't poison it. All right, uh, it just doesn't die today. That is pretty. And I get the feeling it wants to kill me. Comb jelly. The jellyfish are now attacking me and I don't like it. You 
got flask. Cool. Oxygen. Even better. Scary thing. Did it just blow up? Hmm. Is this a sea people building? Door is locked. Can't knock it open. Pink seashell. Oh my god. They just blow themselves up. What are these things? Ammunition. Good. Beow. Flask. Scrap iron. Okay, so I did follow the signal. Oh, I didn't follow the signal. I'm dumb. Turmeric. All right. Hmm. How heavy are these? I can carry two. All right. Maybe this will be oxygen. Ooh. Underwater scooter. Very nice. Ow. Okay, I think I've got this figured out. Yeah, the underwater scooter is really nice. All right, and we're through. Then we go down here. Oh, you'll attack me. Got some oxygen if I need it. Yeah, they blow up now. <laughs> so stupid. Maybe you'll have an oxygen for me. You do. Uh, we'll get rid of the underwater scooter, actually. The underwater scooter is nice, but oxygen is necessary. Okay. Let's get this oxygen. <laughs> Found the people. Huh? It's the sea people from before. Oh, you're okay. Um, they're saying something. I can't tell what they're saying. I have to call Dr. Bacon. My goodness, wow! To think the sea people were real, it's simply incredible. Um, they're saying something to me, but I can't understand them. Hmm, I think analyzing the patterns might allow us to translate. Come back up to the boat for now. I'll think of a way to translate. We're just not gonna harass them any further. All right, this is a much longer trip than I was expecting. Uh, so this will have to be where I end. Um, and then later, we'll, we'll cook tomorrow or not tomorrow. The next time I play, we'll cook. But I gotta make some phone calls today before I leave to get beer. Oh, we're back in the depths. We're back out of the depths. All right, let's go. Yay. I would call that a successful trip. And the, the eddies are being kind enough to blow us out of here.
I guess you caught near the end of the stream. Yeah, I'm sorry. But you did make it. And I do appreciate it. Cheers for beer, but not too much. She demands fun and such. And her friends keep in touch. Yeah, that's one of the reasons I enjoy it. It just gives me a chance to catch up with one of my friends. It's become our weekly thing. She and I were in the same situation with the building that... um got shut down and she landed on her feet a lot faster and I will I will have to be the one who pays for our drinks once I can hmm I did expect the sea people civilization to be real but to think they are living sea people this is truly the find of a century this is thanks to you Dave going deeper Ha <laughs> ha Let's tell all the news outlets in the world about this. Wait, I think that might be risky. But why? That's how we'll get people flock into this place. Wouldn't matter if we were talking about some ruins, but these are living sea people. Poachers are bound to show up. They'll start hunting the sea people since that way will since that'll be a way to get a lot of attention. You have a point there. How about we first make a translator to analyze their sound waves and figure out what they're saying? I think they have something to tell us. We'll first need a Sea People stone tablet with their writing on it, as well as a microphone and an amethyst. If I'm guessing right, the microphone should be below the sunken ship and the stone tablet is likely to be in their record chamber. I can hear you mi can mine amethyst at 100 meters or deeper with a pickaxe. Mm. I already have an amethyst! Let's go! My friggin' need to collect everything has paid off. The record chamber, the ship, and... <laughs> if you can't remember the locations, check the to-do app. I'll add the information there. Bye! We didn't almost die. The building just closed. We It went bankrupt and we had no job. But most of us, at least, we planned for the future because you never know what's going to happen with anything, anytime. So, I mean, I have enough savings, had enough savings for the six months that they tell you to have savings for. It just so happens that the other freaking job was like, no, you can't start till January. And so I was like, oh, new job, new, new job. Uh, Dave, are you busy? Not at the moment. What is it? I have a strange customer at the sushi bar. Could you come over for a moment? As the manager, this is... As the manager, this is something I can't overlook. I'll come over right away. A noisy customer, not a Karen. Udo? Wait, can I have a moment with you? Yes, I'm sorry you are. <laughs> I should introduce myself first. I'm a reporter for the magazine Weekly Fish. The name is Udo. Oh, I've read that magazine too. It covers unique fish species. Oh, you have? That's right. Yeah. I heard the blue hole is home to some to a variety of fish species. Is that true? Mm. You could say that. There are all kinds of fish species from around the world. Mm. Oh, I knew it. So I've come to the right place. Yeah. I'd love to take pictures of myself for the magazine, but unfortunately, I can't dive. Oh. Speaking of which, would you help me take some pictures? Mm. Pictures? Yeah. Yes, you have that nice camera over there. How does he know that? And how did he get my number? Oh, it's the one from Do mm. Dr. Bacon. But I'm no expert in photography. I'm not sure if I'm good enough. Don't worry. If you're a reader of Weekly Fish, you'll get a feel for what kinds of fish to photograph. And of course, I'll reward you if you take a nice picture. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, if you say so. All right. It'd be nice to make a record of this amazing world. You can take pictures of living creatures at a photo spot. Take your pictures to Udo to claim rewards. Wrap up your day and get things ready at Boncho Sushi. Has been added as a contact. Hello, new person. I don't want to actually call you. I just talked to you. Stop being so clingy. <laughs> Wait, did I miss one? Oh, yeah, I got a Harlequin hind. All right, that's where I have to drop you off. Um, settings, close game. Save. Manual. Yes. Day 20. All right. Um, I'm actually going to have to just go. Um, yes. Nice to have that avenue and catch up with friends. Cigar and whiskey about once a month. All right. Yeah, I got to go. I got to make a phone call uh, and I don't have much time. So I will see everybody later. Um, if anybody is on, just go give them a friendly hello. Uh, not that you win it anyway, but yeah, if you're going to just 
just know that that my my heart and soul are with you and <laughs> greeting them today um okay uh talk to everybody later i gotta go have a good day and i will be back tomorrow for i don't know because saturday is dark souls so <laughs> i'll see you all later bye